Chandrayaan-3 is a follow-on mission to Chandrayaan-2 to demonstrate end-to-end -end capability in safe landing and roving on the lunar surface. It consists of lander and rover configuration. It will be launched by LVM-3 from STSC Sharn, Sriharikota. The propulsion module will carry the lander and rover configuration till 800 km lunar orbit. The propulsion module has spectropolarimetry of habitable planet Earth, shape, payload to study the spectral and polarimetric measurements of Earth from the lunar orbit. Lander payloads, Chandra's surface thermophysical experiment, chased, to measure the thermal conductivity and temperature, instrument for lunar seismic activity, ILSA, for measuring the seismicity around the landing site. Lang your probe, LP, to estimate the plasma density and its variations. A passive laser retroreflector array from NASA is accommodated for lunar laser ranging studies. Rover payloads, alpha particle X-ray spectrometer, UPS, and laser-induced breakdown spectroscope, LIBS, for deriving the elemental composition in the vicinity of landing site. Chandrayaan-3 consists of an indigenous lander module, LM, propulsion module, PM, and a rover with an objective of developing and demonstrating new technologies required for interplanetary missions. The lander will have the capability to soft land at a specified lunar site and deploy the rover which will carry out in-situ chemical analysis of the lunar surface during the course of its mobility. The lander and the rover have scientific payloads to carry out experiments on the lunar surface. The main function of PM is to carry the LM from launch vehicle injection till final lunar 800 km circular polar orbit and separate the LM from PM. Apart from this, the propulsion module also has one scientific payload as a value addition which will be operated post-separation of lander module. The launcher identified for Chandrayaan-3 is LVM-3M4 which will place the integrated module in an elliptic parking orbit, IPO, of size 670 x 36,500 km. The mission objectives of Chandrayaan-3 are to demonstrate safe and soft landing on lunar surface to demonstrate rover roving on the moon and to conduct in-situ scientific experiments. To achieve the mission objectives, several advanced technologies are present in lander such as AIC altimeters, laser and RF-based altimeters though velocimeters, laser Doppler velocimeter and lander horizontal velocity camera clean inertial measurement, laser gyro-based inertial referencing and accelerometer package chart propulsion system, 800 and throttleable liquid engines, 58 and attitude thrusters and throttleable engine control electronics punch navigation, guidance and control, NGC power descent trajectory design and associate software elements chair hazard detection and avoidance, lander hazard detection and avoidance camera and processing algorithm SAT landing leg mechanism. To demonstrate the above set advanced technologies in Earth condition, several lander special tests have been planned and carried out successfully with Integrated Coal Test For the demonstration of integrated sensors and navigation performance test using helicopter as test platform integrated hot test For the demonstration of closed-loop performance test with sensors, actuators and NGC using tower crane as test platform lander leg mechanism performance test on a lunar simulant test bed simulating different touchdown conditions. 1. Mission Life, Lander and Rover, 1 Lunar Day, Tilda 14 Earth Days, 2. Landing Site, Prime 4 km by 2.4 km 69.367621S, 32.348126E, 3. Science Payloads Lander, 1. Radio Anatomy of Moonbound Hypersensitive Ionosphere and Atmosphere, Rambha, 2. Chandra Surface Thermophysical Experiment, Cha STE, 3. Instrument for Lunar Seismic Activity, ILSA, 4. Laser Retroreflector Array, LRA, Rover, 5. Alpha Particle X-ray Spectrometer, APXS, 6. Laser Induced Breakdown Spectroscope, LIBS, Propulsion Module, 7. Spectropolarimetry of Habitable Planet Earth, Shape, 4. Two-Module Configuration, 1. Propulsion Module, Carries Lander from Launch Injection to Lunar Orbit, 2. Lander Module, Rover is accommodated inside the Lander, 5. Mass 1. Propulsion Module, 2148 kg 2. Lander Module, 1752 kg including Rover of 26 kg 3. Total, 3900 kg 6. Power Generation 1. Propulsion Module, 758 W2. Lander Module, 738 watts, WS with bias 3. Rover, 50 watts 7. Communication 1. Propulsion Module, communicates with IDSN 2. Lander Module, communicates with IDSN and Rover. Chandrayaan 2 Orbiter is also planned for contingency link. 3. Rover, communicates only with Lander. 8. Lander Sensors 1. 
NASA Inertial Referencing and Accelerometer Package, LIRAP-2, Ka Band Altimeter, Ka RA-3, Lander Position Detection Camera, LPDC-4, LIRAC, Lander Hazard Detection and Avoidance Camera, 5, Laser Altimeter, LASA-6, Laser Doppler Velocimeter, LDV-7, Lander Horizontal Velocity Camera, LHVC-8. MicroStar Sensor 9, Inclinometer and Touchdown Sensors, 9. Lander Actuators Reaction Wheels, 4 Nose, 10 NMS and 0.1 Newton Meters, 10. Lander Propulsion System by Propellant Propulsion System, MMH Plus Moon 3, 4 Nose, of 800 N Throttleable Engines and 8 Nose, of 58 N Throttleable Engine Control Electronics, 11. Lander Mechanisms 1. Lander Leg 2. Rover Ramp, Primary and Secondary, 3. Rover 4. ILSA, Rambha and Chased Payloads 5. Umbilical Connector Protection Mechanism, 6. Expand Antenna, 12. Lander Touchdown Specifications 1. Vertical Velocity, less than or equal to 2 meters per second 2. Horizontal Velocity, less than or equal to half a meter per second 3. Slope, less than or equal to 12 degrees. 1. Radio Anatomy of Moonbound Hypersensitive Ionosphere and Atmosphere, Rambha, Langmuir Probe, LP, to measure the near-surface plasma, ions and electrons, density and its changes with time 2. Chandra Surface Thermophysical Experiment, CHA-ST, to carry out the measurements of thermal properties of lunar surface near polar region. 3. Instrument for Lunar Seismic Activity, ILSA, to measure seismicity around the landing site and delineating the structure of the lunar crust and mantle. 4. Laser Retroreflector Array, LRA, it is a passive experiment to understand the dynamics of moon system. 1. Laser Induced Breakdown Spectroscope, LIBS, qualitative and quantitative elemental analysis and to derive the chemical composition and infer mineralogical composition to further our understanding of lunar surface. 2. Alpha Particle X-ray Spectrometer, APXS, to determine the elemental composition, Mg, Al, C, K, Ca, T, Fe, of lunar soil and rocks around the lunar landing site. 1. Spectropolarimetry of habitable planet Earth, shape, future discoveries of smaller planets and reflected light would allow us to probe into variety of exoplanets which would qualify for habitability or for presence of life.